Could this be the next big thing in sneakers? Nike sure hopes so. A company that's been connected with the future of footwear for decades. Our laces, all right. Now, this is Nike's new project, Amplify, billed as the world's first powered footwear system. These shoes are just building on the last decade plus of innovation and in super shoes at Nike. Think of it as a bionic Achilles tendon. It's an upgraded Nike sneaker with a flexible cuff battery that wraps around the calf and a motor powering your every step, all with the goal of making running and even walking a whole lot easier. We're still in prototype phase. It's not yet available for customers, but we got to try out a pair. I think they're snug. Perfect. I think we're good. So we're just gonna give you a chance to walk around in those a little bit. They just be like some tall boots or something. But what this is doing is kind of the first step in the get to know you process between okay. you and them. The big, I guess, change will be when you actually flip that switch. It takes a bit of walking for the tech to calibrate to your muscles and gait, but after that switch is flipped. So oh you can feel I it. feel it, yeah. Um, we call that the hug. You're off. <laughs> I'm feeling like Superman, I guess. <laughs> It's uh, kind of effortless. Yeah, that, it feels like a muscle, like it moves with me. It's like an extra assist. And that's the magic. It's not like a constant force. It feels like at a certain point in my run, then I feel like the boost hit. And my producer got to try it out with me. Okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I do kind of feel like I'm on the moon. Yeah. Moon sensations, totally. The shoes can be worn with or without the robotics, and the system is controlled through an app. Director of Footwear Innovation at Nike, Michael Donahue, says it's been in the works for years now. Amplify, really simply, it's an idea about helping people move more, whether that's faster or further. It's about just giving people a little more ability. So you may be wondering, who is this shoe really designed for? Maybe my dad would still go on a jog with me if he had this. I don't really think this has a place in the competitive world. But if you look at a lot of even elite athlete kind of modalities for recovery, how do you take some of the stress or strain off of um, a marathon or when they're in their taper phase? The tech is not without criticism though. I, I don't like the fact that we're getting to a point where everything requires a battery. Like, what if it leads to muscle weakness or over-reliance? In that regard, designers don't see it as that different than an e-bike, but they know the human body is much more complicated than wheels. Amplify is not running for you or walking for you, it's running with you. Even I had a slight mishap with the prototype, breaking the casing when I got too close to it a wall. To you, but oh. Parts they say would be more durable in the final product. We reached out to some competitive footwear brands to see if they're working on anything like this, and they either didn't respond or pointed us to other unrelated innovations. It's the best shoe that we ever built. Some of the real innovation behind Nike's shoe is the battery powering it. That's super thin and flexible, so all of the tech doesn't get in the way of the experience. We can put the athlete back at the center always we're gonna end up with a better solution. For now, the team is satisfied that it's decade plus of design is making those who use it have some fun. We thank you for watching and remember, stay updated on breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or watch live on our YouTube channel.